We're a three-year-old brand. We're all about positive, uplifting, meaningful content. We reach, according to Comscore, 55.8 million women. That makes us the largest standalone lifestyle site, the largest URL reaching women. We also do three hours of live programming a month, which reaches an audience of 13 million. And it's all really, it's this incredibly lofty, yet this simple mission of we just want to make our audience happy. Well, I think the secret to the success, there's three aspects to it. One, that we're very protective of our audience. So there's both the user experience, we have a very ad light site, you don't have any of the content recommendation widgets, so it loads faster and it's a very clean, brand safe experience. And our content is all positive, uplifting and meaningful. So we all know that there are challenging things going on in the world and there's plenty of places for an audience to get that content. That We're not that, we're respite from that. So the combination of sort of the business discipline to be protective of the audience and the content that we create and the demand of the market right now for some place where you can go and get positive good news and read about, learn about, and share the goodness in the world, there's an incredible demand for it and we're the largest site out there fulfilling it. Our goal with branded and sponsored content is that it's woven in, whether it's a sponsorship of one of our live shows or a custom video that we do for a brand telling a story. So it's the same team that does both our original content that's purely editorial and the branded, and it's our storytelling. So we can tell a story that our writers, editors, and researchers have found, and if a brand wants to join us on that journey, it's an incredible service to the audience and to the brand. And it's really about touching the heartstrings. We announced our 13th show today, so we produce in our offices 13 different shows. They're all 30 to 60 minute. They're episodic. Uh, most of, 10 of them are once a week. One of them is seven days a week and the other two are daily. And those currently are available on our site and on Facebook Live, but this summer we'll be launching out to the five platforms that I mentioned. For us, we made a decision to, over two years ago that we wanted our content to be available where our audience is. So we have a very aggressive distribution strategy, particularly with Facebook. We also do testing at a level that no one else does. So we publish less than many others to Facebook, but what we publish has the highest engagement per article of anybody doing that. So what happens is we, it's almost like a front door. And then that audience comes to the site and consumes the content. And we feel that that's really where the future is, that there's so many places that people are interacting socially and consuming content that we want our content to be where they are. But the experience, we want to control that user experience to have it be brand safe, the content surrounding it, the ads. So they come to our site to read the story and watch the video.